little different rink side this week as we've been elevated to an intermission segment. And I'm here with assistant coach of the Huskies, Eric Root. And coach, you're no stranger to St. Cloud State, having been here as an assistant coach under Bob Motzko's era and at the helm as head coach for the women's team. What brought you back to St. Cloud State? Well, I love for the area, I love for the people of the area, a lot of friends. Uh, I love working at St. Cloud State. This is a, a remembering how special it is down there in the locker rooms. It's an easy place to come back to, that's for sure. Well, we'll talk about the team soon, I promise. But I first got to ask, your son, Max Rude, yep. playing for the Gophers, I mean, it's kind of like blasphemy around here. Um, but how's he liking it, and how did that kind of go down? Uh, he loves it. He loves it. He's really had a good experience so far. You know, he just wanted to see something new, see something different, uh, uh, live in a big city. But I understand when you're young and you wanted to experience something new, and, and so far he's had a great experience. And Coach Larson has been here since 2018. What's it been like coaching alongside him? Uh, awesome. Uh, it, we've known each other for a long time. Played roller hockey together way back in the day, but but grew up playing against each other, whether it was high school, college, pro. We've always kind of known each other. and uh, uh, We get along. We're very compatible, I think. The whole staff, everyone around here has just been great. And the Huskies have a real balanced attack this season. I mean, we're seeing pretty evenly goals coming from the defensive and offensive lines. What are you noticing from this year's squad and their ability to score from nearly anywhere in the ozone oh every week we we put a little more of our offense in and and, uh, and you're right last weekend we got goals by defensemen which we really haven't had so far and that was an emphasis coming out of the michigan weekend we want to have so it was nice for those guys to chip in i think we're, we're just on the verge of breaking out offensively a little bit uh, but we don't want to do it uh, at the expense of our defensive game because that's been what's what's really uh, got us off to a great start so far and speaking of defense, I can't talk to a coach and not ask about Isaac Posh. I mean, come on, a two-time already weekly NCHC award winner. He's one of three goaltenders in all of NCAA hockey right now to have more than one shutout on this season. What does this early season success mean to the rest of the team from a coach's standpoint? Posh has been just excellent back there. It's been a, a, a real key to the start of our season uh, uh, for sure. But there's been so many uh, uh, just positive things around here that have led us to this great start. And, and obviously goaltending is one of them. And the newcomers, Bernovic, Ralph, Thoris, and Zinger. I mean, they've all made a super big impact pretty early on in the season. Is this the future of college hockey? I mean, with the transfer portal and younger players making an immediate impact, we saw it last year with this weekend's opponent, Boston College, that nearly won a natty led by underclassmen. I think overall it's been a positive thing, uh, uh, certainly for us. Players that have come out of the portal have had good impact on this program. We've had some guys get fresh starts here, and, and, and it's turned out to, to help everyone. Well, thank you so much for your time today, Coach Root. I really appreciate it and your insight on this series. That's all for this episode of Ringside.